Same's Arc System Works and Limited Run Games have come together to make a Double Dragon collection, including several uh, titles. Now, the problem I have with this collection is <laughs> just how many titles are missing. Now, up front, I will tell you that it does seem that this collection is Nintendo platform focused, probably because it's coming out for, you know, by Limited Run Games in physical form for $40 or $100, depending on which version you want to get. It's coming out from the Nintendo Switch. So it kind of makes sense to make a Nintendo-centric focus with the collection. I get that. My problem with this collection is, is all of the Nintendo platform t Double Dragon games that are missing, particularly all of the Game Boy Advance, or excuse me, the Game Boy entries, which there was iterations, they weren't exactly arcade perfect, but there was Double Dragon 1, 2, and 3, and then of course there's uh, we're missing Double Dragon and Battletoads, which I understand Microsoft owns Battletoads now, so can't really, you know, I don't know put money into this and make it a great collection. What you're getting is that you are getting the Game Boy Advance uh, version of Double Dragon Advance and you're getting the Double Dragon 4 for the Nintendo Switch which was already released on Nintendo Switch but now you can get it in physical form. Yay? Um, I'm just not really impressed with this collection. Uh, there are so many missing... No collection like this is ever going to be perfect because publishers have to run make, make a cash run. If they made one ultimate collection and were able to miraculously include the PC Engine version of Double Dragon 2, which had different cinematics, voice acting, and a unique unique art style, and include the Double Dragon games on, say, various computers, and from the uh, or just keep it to consoles and just include the Sega Genesis versions. I mean, I'm not even asking for the Zebo version or Zebu, whatever the hell that. Uh, console was yeah you know, by the time this gets published pre-orders will be closed it's not going to be available anymore so you'll be having to stick to ebay scalpers my question is is this is this even a collection you're interested in i mean i don't understand how hard it would have been to bring in a, you know at least make this the ultimate nintendo platform collection and, and include you know at least the game boy you know versions of one two and three if not about with battletoads anyhow let me know in the comments below what you think of this